Yeah, you know, guys, I think everybody wants them to take a tackle in the first round, and that's their biggest need. But when you look at this roster and how many short-term fixes they have and how many question marks they're going to have after the season, whether it's age or just, again, a guy who's on a one- or two-year deal, I'm not sure there are many positions that are off the table. I think they can go a lot yeah. of different places. And I do think, Brian, your point is a good one, where because of these one- or two, two-year deals, they have starters everywhere, right? So they can say, all right, we're good for this year. This is the best player. We're going to take this player because in two years he's, he's going to fit in somewhere. And then they can take it from there. And then next year, if they have to do more Band-Aid stuff, they will. But I feel like like that's got to be their approach in the draft because the 49ers are not going to be the 49ers as you know them in 2025. Mm -hmm. 2024, sure. going to be a lot of the same faces, but 2025 is going to be different. They have to start planning for that now. And you don't not take a guy who you think is going to be a stud at receiver or defensive tackle or wherever because you really need an offensive tackle where you can't draft for need. You do have to get tackles at some point. But I think, yeah, I, I think it's BPA, man. I, I really do think that's going to be the approach. Now, do you think in the first round, again, the 49ers have never drafted in the first round and not taken an O-lineman, D-lineman, wide receiver, or quarterback. They've never drafted a second-round corner. Like, do you see somebody like Kool-Aid Ministry, who I think is going to be a best player available if he's there at 31? Mm -hmm. I think he's mm -hmm. a damn good player. Could you see the Niners actually drafting a corner in the first round? Never I even do. taking a second-rounder. I do. Yeah. I, a, a guy like Kool-Aid McKinstry for sure. I would love um, him. And the only reason he would drop is because of uh, j just some injury concerns, which I mean, I, I guess that's why they drop. But uh, mm. yeah, I would. I, I I don't think they would be scared to do it. Um, but again, it's just a matter of is there an edge that they value more?